All right, this is team four, the New York Jets. They somehow still share a stadium with the New York Giants. I don't know how, but these are no longer the Zach Wilson led Jets. Thank the Lord. <laughs> this is the the Aaron Rodgers led New York Jets, and boy, we got some. We got a lot going on here, so. He, they brought that so now that Aaron Rodgers is now the quarterback of the team, Zach Wilson looks like a competent quarterback. I don't know how that happened. They traded the 15th, this a fifth rounder, so they still got a 13th. Jesus Christ, the Jets also received a first round pick and the fifth rounder. They sent out the, th the first and a second rounder and a sixth rounder. That was it. The Green Bay Packers are idiots, okay. Now people are probably saying Oh I wouldn't give up a whole lot for Aaron Rodgers They really only gave up a second round pick Because they swapped From 13 to 15 okay, And they swapped from 170 to 207 So unless it was somebody sitting there at 170 That they were just dying to get They couldn't get earlier There's not much There's a second round pick really. So Zach Wilson's back up But with that came a lot of talent from Uh from Green Bay Alan Lazard is there Randall Cobb is there Miko Hartman From the Chiefs is there So They brought in a lot Quincy Wood Quincy Wood I thought that was Quentin Williams Quentin Williams Signed a deal It was just funny Because I was going to record And talk about the Jets that day But I didn't do it Because I was being retarded now, Excuse my language I was being stupid I, I gotta bleep that out I gotta bleep that out My bad Um he signed a deal. I don't know why it took so long. That I don't understand. Some of these teams be killing me. Because it's like certain players. Jerry Jones is a perfect example. If there's somebody who is is on your team and it's pretty obvious they, they need to be paid and you don't want to pay them because for whatever reason you're being stupid, you will look like an idiot at the end of the day. Sign these players because their value will just increase. Because if they didn't sign him... And then the next person signed a contract for 140. Then they're gonna be mad as shit because they didn't pay him what they needed to pay him. I'm sorry, that was that was unnecessary. The Quincy Williams is there. Chuck Clark for the Ravens. Greg Zerline, underrated. Tommy Morris there from the Dolphins. I don't know how Solomon Thomas is still in the league. Then Billy Turner used to play for the. He used to play for the. Uh, he used to play for Green Bay. And then he went to Denver. But I don't think he was made for Denver for Sean Payton and friends. So that's that. Let's look at who they lost. I don't know if these are losses. Oh, Elijah Moore is a loss. I'm kind of sad that he didn't get to work with uh, Aaron Rodgers. Because Zach Woods is an idiot. Uh, Joe Flacco. Mike White, the GOAT, gone. James Robinson, gone. Uh, George Fent. Mike Rimmers is somehow still in the league. Von Miller's bitch. He's still leaves somehow. Laurent Duvernay Tardif. He plays for the Chiefs though. Work. I'm assuming he plays for the Chiefs now because that's his pitcher. Uh, Sheldon Rankins gone. Quan Alexander gone. Lamarcus Joyner gone. So that's who left. Uh. I don't know how the hell Mike Rivers is still in the league. Like, I don't understand. Who is calling for Mike Rivers? All right. We're going to do the draft. And we're going to do a breakdown of the season. So the draft, like I said, there wasn't much missing. They already had a second round pick anyway. It was not like there was much missing. Um, They got more depth on their D-line. D-line wins football games. So as you can see from the Super Bowl, the Eagles not having a D-line lost the Super Bowl. Two Pittsburgh guys, another running back. So I don't really know. These because the defense was really good last year. They had a a playoff, a deep playoff, like defense, like a really good playoff defense, and they just couldn't get there because Zach Wilson stinks. Um, so they boosted a lot of defense. And there's not much that you could say that they needed, like 100 percent needed. So we'll you know. Let me hold on. Let me look at this. Let me look at this. Let me look at their roster real, real quick. Let me talk about their schedule. Who's at safety? So 
So at safety, Ashton Davis is still there. Jordan Whitehead is there. Damn, yeah, Jordan Whitehead. They just drafted him. No, I'm sorry. These aren't. These are signees for the, the season. I mean, the preseason. I mean, yeah, they could have used them, but they got Jordan Whitehead and Ashton Davis, and they're used to it. Uh, hold on one second. All right, I'm sorry. If you can hear my phone in the background, my girlfriend's on the phone. She just needed me on the phone for some safety reasons. But we'll see. I mean, I don't. I don't think maybe they could. They could have used a safety. Who was who was available? It's not a whole lot of S's on the screen. Not a whole lot of safety. So I mean, yeah, maybe. Um. So, I mean, all right, so that's that. Um, but we, we didn't talk about this damn schedule. <laughs> Last year, this video is going over eight minutes, but they don't count because I had to, I got to edit some of this stuff out because I have boyfriend things. So they lost to the Ravens as expected. Today went on a tear. They went on a tear going into the bye week. And then they came out of the bye week. <laughs> and boy, I tell you, they stunk. Um, I, I don't, I had nothing. I got nothing. This is unacceptable. This was the game where Zach Wilson, they asked Zach Wilson, do you think you were the issue today? And you know what he said? The reporter couldn't even finish the question. That's how much of an idiot Zach Wilson is. You managed three fucking points three and somebody gonna ask you do you think you the reason yes admit your faults bro because you stink uh let me see this i was done i was done there was versus the patriots where is it at where is it at Cause I was mad as hell. At the car door, the sideline. Oh right, I mean we called uh, we called a play for. How you played New England? Aside from the turnovers, you were able to move. As well as is, how frustrating was it to not be able to get it? Because I got away from. Oh, you know they're not they're not out there. Ability here, and everyone's trying to. Got a lot of season left, so we're gonna move on and, and try. Score three points. The defense only lets up three points. I mean, do you do you feel like you let the defense down at all? No. What do you mean you didn't, bro? The team, the New England, finished with more points than you had completions. I'm sorry for raising my voice. Bad football and no accountability really grinds my gears. You know what grinds my gears? I'm sorry. You stink. I would much rather you admit, okay, I play bad. I play bad. I need to step up. Then to hear you say, "Damn." No, I wasn't. I wasn't the reason we lost. Yes, you were. New England finished with more points than you had completions. This is a representation of the season. Elijah Moore, a lot, one of the one of the best young receivers in the league, did not understand why he wasn't getting the ball because you suck. God, Jesus. Anyway, I'm done. I'm done talking about the Jets last season. They don't exist. They don't exist anymore. They're not relevant. The Jets this season gonna look like the Denver Broncos with all these damn primetime games. Look at these games. <laughs> Buffalo off rip on 9-11. Um, Dallas, the 425 Dallas game. They got Kansas City week four of the Sunday night game. They got us at the four o'clock game. Then they go to their bye week. The Chargers, why do we keep wanting to see the Chargers on primetime? I don't care. Uh. 3 p.m. Oh, that's Black Friday. I was about to say, what? I didn't know there's Black Friday football. So there's that. They got a bunch of primetime games. They're going to be a whole lot better. And what's crazy is they had a decent record last year. That's what's killing me. If they literally had a competent quarterback, they are not in a scenario. They had one, two, three, four, five, six. It was seven and ten with a bad quarterback. That's how good that defense was. Oh, I'm so frustrated. I'm sorry. This video, I'm looking at it, went over 10 minutes. 
I mean, went over eight minutes because I had to help my girlfriend or some stuff. So this don't count. So this, this one's a little bit different. We're going to let this one slide. But that's it. I'm done. Zach Wilson done pissed me off. I don't want to say thank you for watching. I'm about to do FOMO. I love you. Enjoy the rest of your day. Bye.